hello and thanks for tuning in to my channel if you're new here welcome if you're a returning subscriber hey guys so today guys of course we're doing a what's in my bag and this is my dunia burke florentine satchel in the size large they do come in medium small and was it micro or something like that mini micro i don't know i don't remember all the sizes because i i got the biggest one Reason being is I'm a big bag girl because I carry everything in the kitchen sink. You'll never catch me out for the most part without things that I need. And even when I take a small bag, you best believe if I'm in my car, everything a girl can need is in my trunk, okay? I don't play no games. I'm never going to be caught for the most part. Hopefully never ever without things that I need. <laughs> I'm praying I don't have to unless I was to just hop in a car with somebody else. But then if, as long as I have a big bag... I will have my stuff with me so I'm okay for things that I just feel like I need so anywho let's start with this this is a little um dupe of the coach pouch Flaboo sent me this her channel name is Flaboo 86 she sent me this along with another one because our Walmart just wasn't carrying these and if they did maybe I missed out because I don't go in Walmart often but in here I just have some hand sanitizer so that I can sanitize my hands before I dig in my bag and my AirPods. Normally they are in a cute little case, <laughs> but I just threw them in there because I needed to go. All right, and then I love this, this stitching on the handles. And I know some of you may be like, what kind of strap is that? So what I did was I just doubled my strap. I am actually contemplating getting a Coach Hattie bag and use the strap off that bag with this bag. Wait, I have one. Both sides don't detach. So I guess that wouldn't work. But anywho, I never zipped this bag, which is why this is hanging here. And let me see. Show you what these straps look like. Okay, so we're going to put those straps back there. I never zip because it, it closes, you know. Once you do it like that, you don't need to zip it. It might as well be closed. So, this bag is O. We're going to look in the inside of it. And that is what the inside looks like. And as you can see, my green, is it's, it's, it's ran its course. Okay, so we're going to start with this pocket because it's not a lot of items in this pocket i have some cuticle cream from burt bees i've had this for a very long time um if you've watched my early videos like when i first started my channel <laughs> that is that same burt bees cream okay i have this cute little mirror from uh i almost said five below but i will be lying it's from the dollar tree and it's uh doubled so I like that. Ouch. Pinch my hand. And then, of course, you know, the little pouches from Five Below. And in this pouch, I just have some stamps and my P.O. Box keys. And I thought these stamps were so cute. And they had the pink in it, so I put it in this pouch. So I think this is going to be a pouch that is always in my bag. And I just stuck the keys in there. And... I just zip it like this, okay? None to it but to do it. One of those Dollar Tree lights. I mean, if it's dark, I'm, it will help, okay? Then it flickers. And I had saw Flabu with one of these. I had seen these in the Dollar Tree and I was like, uh. Oh. But then one night, <laughs> I don't know who decided to turn off the interior lights in the car. Like, why? And I could not find the house keys because I keep my house keys separate from my car keys, okay? And I, boy, I was like, let me go get one of them lights. Even though I have another light in here, too, because of that reason. But when I get to that light, you'll see. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was going to say, it has been a while since I have dropped something in a video, <laughs> but I guess here we go. These are some uh, Pro Buds from Walmart. They bought me one day. I forgot my AirPods and I was just so mad. I was trying to listen to something and I was like, I need some type of headphones. And they fit in this little case he found at this little swap store. I don't know what kind of store it was, but when he saw these, he got them for me and I was like, okay, babe, the case that is. So he bought the Air thingies and these. 
All right, and then in his front pocket, I got a little pen. Babe bought me when he went to Disney World. It's Tinkerbell. He bought me a little uh, pouch too. You might have seen it in my earlier videos. Um, I try to switch my pouches out a lot, just like I do my bags, so that they don't get that much wear and tear. Because one bag that I stayed in for a very long time, like didn't really swap out too much, was my Neverfull. Um, and the Damier being print. Anytime I traveled, I used that bag. Uh, I worked, that was my work horse, okay? Like, it could carry everything. My lunch, my drink, my snacks, my iPad, my planner. Like, it could carry everything I needed to take with me to work. So, I wore that bag out. But, anywho, that is that. <laughs> All right, and then we're going to empty these little pockets. Of course, a little taser, which was a Christmas gift from my soon-to-be stepson. <laughs> okay, and then I have my scent of the day y'all i am so mad they did away with this this is donna karen cashmere white i have gotten so many and i mean so many compliments so many compliments with this scent i am so mad like if anybody knows or seen this being sold on a on a one of those let go sites or anything of that nature please let me know because i will go on that site and order as many of these as they have because it is a nice inexpensive everyday scent i love the way it it compliments me like my pheromones and this goes well together and it's a nice everyday scent to where it's like okay it didn't cost 400 dollars, so i don't care about spraying it um i have the spray and i have the roll on the donna can uh can't even talk the donna karen cashmere mist though i'm not i'm not i'm not a fan of that it's like a musk uh, me and that one don't get along all right and these um as y'all know, if y'all seen my videos, this has the writing a little bit. But in my early videos, you would see me with a lip gloss with a white top. Yes, come from the Dollar Tree. Y'all, the Dollar Tree has been my best friend since I had my third son. I was a single mom, um, out here not making a lot, you know, trying to keep up with the lifestyle I used to have when I only had one and two kids. Oh, it was it was not working. I was paying five hundred twenty nine dollars for a Cadillac SRX truck, rent, light, gas, water. I was in a house, so you know you paying all those little utilities that come with the house. And then I had a dog, and whoo, whoo, whoo. when I tell you, sometimes I had to go to Dollar Tree and get a bag of rice. I had to go to the Dollar Tree and get the four pack of tissue. I had to go to the Dollar Tree. So today, I still go to the Dollar Tree, like. If I was to become a millionaire, I think there are certain things that I'm still gonna go to the Dollar Tree and get. Like, why not? Even though it's a dollar twenty-five cent store now. But this color, y'all, I love it on my skin. There it is. And then when I'm just, you know, just look everyday lip that's inexpensive, especially during COVID, I would mix this, mix it with this almond and. That would be how my lips look, you know? Nice little shimmer, cute little color. This is Coral Crush, which is my favorite, and this is Socialite. And I'm actually just gonna put that on my lips from off my hand. <laughs> Nothing goes to waste around here. All right, anywho. <laughs> Y'all, my mind be spacing. Anywho, let me keep going. Uh, <laughs> I'm just humbled. I have some disinfectant fabric and air freshener and I'm taking some pills y'all and sometimes I just have to go to the bathroom okay and I don't I don't want people to walk in the bathroom and be like oh you know because they know what stall is coming from <laughs> especially if ain't nobody in the bathroom but you and them and then you come out while they and then they come out and they looking at you you're like oh my god I'm so sorry I mean you know whatever but I have lifestyle too because if they don't have those little sheets baby I'm about to spray that toilet I'm gonna wipe it down I'm gonna spray it again wipe it down and then I, I'm gonna have to do what I need to do so I keep that lifestyle and that um this odor eliminator in my bag and then I just have a random pen from Xfinity I love the way this pen right though like the blue on it is love it and it's a stylist then I have my eyeglass cleaner um again if you've been watching my video since I started you have seen this before it's not new some tissues 
Uh, oh, I was trying to figure out how much my son's phone bill was gonna be because he needs to start paying it. Just a random, pay, uh, what is that? Sentence, what is that thing? Panty liner. And then I have my pen. Oh my God, it is so beautiful. Okay, let me stop. But look at the shine on that thing, y'all. Y'all see those sparkles? Whew, so pretty. All right. That is it for those pockets. And I have my keys attached to this, so I'm gonna go ahead and take, no, I'm not gonna take them off because I need to put my stuff back in this bag. I'll probably wear it tomorrow because I really don't have anywhere to go. And it's the keys. Um, babe got them taped up. He won't let me use the newer one. He's just like, nah, you gonna use that one. Like, I'm not the one breaking stuff, sir. But anywho, <laughs> those are the keys to the car. And guys, um, no, nah, I'm not gonna stand it up yet. So I have my glasses. I found this pouch at the Dollar Tree. Y'all know I love these type of pouches for my glasses. Nothing too big and bulky. I used to wear, used to wear, used to have the big, thick, oh my God, like this, eyeglass cases, like Gucci's. Y'all, them, them cases too big for me like so i just have this little case and i try to keep it somewhere safe you know so that way my glasses don't get messed up and i have another pouch i love this pouch out of all them little cute pouches i must say this one is my favorite i used to think i like the one i say i can't even with the lashes but no baby i love this one that elephant is just something about the elephant that I love. Um, oh my God, I love, they, their memory is amazing. And you know, I just love, I just love the elephant. This is cute. Cause I could talk about animals all day long. And guys, this was the phone case I was wearing today. It is from the Dollar Tree, of course. But y'all know, my phone case can be $500. That mug can be 75 cents. If it's cute to me, I am gonna buy it. I'm not one of those people that be like, oh, I'm only wearing Louis because I can afford Louis. Or I'm only wearing Chanel because I can afford Chanel. Or I'm only, no, I'm gonna wear whatever's cute to me. Whatever is cute to me. And this was so cute to me. So I bought it. And then I have, as you guys know, the little phone stand. So when I'm watching something, I can just put my phone up there or my iPad. And that is it. So this is what I'm in today. All right, some gum. This is Arctic Grape. I must say, I'm not a fan of this one as much as I am of this one. This is Babe's favorite, and he turned me on to the Black Cherry. And I call myself buying the Black Cherry, but didn't pay attention that it was actually Arctic Grape. So now I'm stuck trying to eat these. All right, and I decided I'm gonna use this slip from at Fly Boo. I don't even know why I said at Fly Boo, y'all. It's late, I'm getting sleepy, and I need to not record when I'm sleepy, because just like when I used to do my cash envelope videos, OMG, it's like, what are you saying? What are you talking about? And I'm not gonna edit this. I'm just gonna upload it the way it is, bloopers and all. So I'm actually gonna go get me some more deposit slips, and I'm just gonna keep those in here. This is gonna be my little bank envelope. Um, any money that would need to go back to the bank, any money that I need to take out of the bank, because soon when I go back to work, I'm going to be starting my cash stuffing all over again. I haven't worked at all this summer. I have had income coming in from two different streams, but I've been so busy back and forth on the highway living here at my home and in Illinois that y'all cash stuffing was the last thing. Like, I, mm -mm, mm -mm. I couldn't add one more thing to do. I could not. I have some Yes face wipes. I bought these from the Dollar Tree when they had a few of those. I grabbed a couple of them because these are a few dollars that like Walmart or any CVS, any place else. And I'm like, I'm paying a, a dollar. They were actually a dollar when I bought them, not a dollar 25. Um, I went to the Dollar Tree and I didn't need a bag. I got these little thanks cards because a few people asked me for my PO box information so that they can send me some gifts. And I was like, girl, let me go get a P.O. Box then. Hold on. And I bought these. So in case they do put a return address, I am going to send them a thank you note. Because 
For random strangers to just want to send you something, don't know you from Adam's house cat, you know what I'm saying? And they just like, oh, this made me think of that individual. Yeah, that touched my heart. Touched my heart. And it was a few of them, which was so crazy. It was like every day somebody was inboxing me like, what's your PO? And I'm like, okay, okay. Um, I, I probably need to go through my Instagram and find out what their names are. I know them, but I don't know them. <laughs> like, I know when I see them in my inbox, but uh, I don't know their names. But ladies, if you're watching this and you know within the last two weeks you've asked to send me something and I was like, well, I don't have a P.O. box and, you know, I don't know where to have it sent to because I'm not at home and, you know, I've been back and forth, you're going to get one of these, okay? All right, next. Once I had bought that little light, I was like, I need to go get a real light. And this T-Mobile light, which it was in a pocket. I don't even know why it's not in the pocket now, but this mug can find stuff a little better than the other one. So I decided to put this in my bag as well. It was one of those free T-Mobile Tuesday gifts. And yes, I have T-Mobile as a cell phone company. And y'all know the other day, their gift was this. And I was like, your girl needs that. I love the little, um, what is these, palm tree leaves? But I thought this was cute. So I have a pink wine tumbler as well that I got from T-Mobile Tuesdays one time. You know, I got the hat, I had the umbrella. Oh my God, I've had the scarf, which is somewhere around here. The cooler bags for when you're going out to the park and you just want to keep something cool or when you're going to the grocery store and you want to put your groceries in there. It was these little T-Mobile bags. And everybody in my house got T-Mobile, so I was making everybody go to T-Mobile with me so we can get those. <laughs> oh my God, I'm horrible. Yes, I was making everybody go to T-Mobile and get them gifts. Okay, anywho. Um, I bought this set to go in this purse. This is the Coach Horse and Carriage. I don't believe this was part of the Pride collection. I think this was just something they released. If it is part of the Pride collection, let me know because I don't know. And uh, look, that's that color. Where's that? I have bought a new one. This one is old. BLG 66. Y'all see that? Nope. It's the same. One's just a few years old and one's not. I think they still the same color though. They say um, makeup expires. Wait, Coral Crush. So they've changed it a little bit, but maybe this one is old and expired. <laughs> this one, I tell y'all this right here. I know this gotta be at least three years old. I ain't gonna even lie, like it's old. That's what made me buy these because I'm like, all the ones I have like this are a few years old. And maybe it's time that I go ahead and buy some more and throw the old ones away. But y'all, when we had to wear the mask, I was only wearing Dollar Tree lip gloss. I was not about to put my Chanel on. When I wipe off, it looks like the same color though. So my Dollar Tree lip glosses and my NYX lip glosses were my best friends during COVID because you wanted to have lip gloss on, but you had to have a mask on and I was not finna let my mask wear all my Chanel lip gloss off. I promise I was not. I don't care if I own 8, 10, 12, 15, 20 of them. I was not. This is just a little lady pouch. Um, I had that cute colorful bag on that I got from Amazon and I had decided to use all my little pouches like this in that bag. So since this was a little lady pouch with the feminine stuff, I was like, let me just grab the whole pouch and throw it in my bag, you know? So, and I need to throw that little random panty liner in there too. Wherever it went, I'll find it and put it in there. All right, and then next I have the Nolita 19. Y'all, the other little bag was called a corner zip bracelet. Oh, I guess I shouldn't have had this purse down like that the whole video, huh? So this is my Nolita 19 and in it, don't talk about me, don't don't talk about me. Oh, some hand sanitizer, corkscrew, 
the wine heads and all of these are receipts that I need to put on fetch and um, receipt hog. And I don't know if I have anything for Ibotta. And I bought some of these for my car, but like I say, babe has my car. So I was like, let me just keep them in my pouch. So once he comes home and I'm back in my car, I can stick them in there. Um, I had bought a Foreman grill. So here's my little um, protection plan. Oh God, it is just receipt after receipt after receipt that I need to go through. All right. So I decided to make this wrist with the receipt pouch. And as you can see, the receipts definitely took up the space. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this right here because we are getting down to the nitty gritty of what's in this bag. All right, next, I just have this um, pochette, accessor pochette accessoire. I have some money that needs to go to the bank in there. Oh, something in my eye, y'all, I'm so sorry. Okay. All right, and then this is what's in this bag. I have my tech pouch because like I told you, I was using the one case. So in this pouch is just um, a USC type cord that go, you know, goes in the block and my Apple watch and my phone. Like, so I have two chargers, but they both have different ends. One's a USB, one's a USC. So whichever person got the block to work, that's what cord I'm gonna pull out and use. <laughs> I only have a, a USB block in here somewhere. Yep, there it go. And I had to, of course, mark my blocks because everybody around the house has iPhones and they be trying to take my stuff. And then I'm like, okay, well, if you get it and then I see it and it's sticky, that's gonna let me know you took tape off, meaning it was mine still. So I just have my pill case. Um, we went fishing the other day, so I did have my AirPods in this cute little case. This came from Dollar Tree. It's like a watertight pouch. And then I just had my little floaty devices hooked on here too. So in case my AirPods went in the water, I'll be able to get my net and just grab them out because they will float. All right, and then I just have my um, key pouch. And as you guys know, I keep my insurance cards, extra cash in there. I don't know what I did with my house key. Where's that house key now that I'm in this bag? Um, so I just have some candies that should be in a pouch. Um, I have my change pouch. Oh, you know what? That's what's in here. Candy. This withers, y'all. This one, the caramel apple, baby. One of my faves. This is just a caramel chewy one. Sometimes when I'm in the store and little kids be crying, I'm like, can they have a piece of candy? And I give them the chewy one. Here, chew this and be quiet. All right, next is just another little um, bath and body work eucalyptus spearmint air freshener. Top two of them little pins from the Dollar Tree. And a penny. What's in here? Something else is still in there. Some more candy. Oh, there's my house key. <laughs> I'm like, I know my house key should be somewhere. All right, let me stick that in there. That way, I know where it's at. And then I have like a little something from the Dollar Tree, some little notes to go on my planner. That was probably in this bag since who knows how long when. And that is all that is in this bag, y'all. This bag is heavy on its own, okay? it's This bag is heavy, heavy by itself. So, you know, I sometimes I try not to put a lot of stuff in there. So like all the little stuff I bought from Dollar Tree, just all those receipts, even though they're lightweight, you know, just the bag is heavy. So I try not to put too much stuff in this bag, but I do have stuff that I need. And I don't know why, because sometimes if somebody start cutting grass around me and dust start flying or you driving and you drive through dust or you were walking and dust kick up, I like to wipe my face, like, because that does gets on you. Oh, I don't need to put these in there. These are gonna stay home and await a home to go to. All right, guys, so that is it. That is all for my what's in my bag. <laughs> um, That is it, that is all. I hope you guys enjoy seeing what this bag can hold. 
Uh, maybe you found something uh, that I carry that you like, you know what? I need that. I don't know. Cause I've watched tons of videos and I see stuff. I'm like, Oh, you know what? That I need that. Let me go and grab that little, let me go grab that. You know, a little inspiration. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye y'all.